So now, let's bring you to the men's javelin, the F-37 and 38. This is Dimitri Silovs. It's a multi-category event, so it's being decided by points. Silovs, the reigning European champion, silver at the last two world championships. A solid effort. 54.86 in the opening round, a European record. 53 metres 15, not an improvement, but the European record is still his. Yes, this is a, a points category again. This is Mitchell Dutton of Great Britain, first major championship from the St Albans Club, lives in Watford. And that's gone beyond 30 metres anyway. And it is points. Dutton was in fifth going into that throw. That's his third round attempt. 33.96, 36.09, 650 points. He's 119 behind bronze at the moment, which is Petr Vratler, the Czech Republic. Silovs of Latvia leading with the European record, 54.86, which equates to 1,055 points. Dutton needing a couple of metres before he can uh, get into the top four, and he hasn't got it. 34.66. And he stays in fifth place. Silovs, our leader for Latvia. Now 5-2-2, Lukas Tsarnecki of Poland, who's lying in fourth place. This is the fifth round now. His first major championship, he's 16 years old. 38-11, lifetime best, coming in round one. Well, again, that's beyond 30 metres, comfortably so. Mitchell Dutton's uh, fifth round throw was 31.56. Sarnecki so with 38-11 uh, in the first round is about 80 points behind Peter Rattle in the bronze medal position. It's Alexander Lyshenko of Russia who's in second place at the moment. And 36-41 is not an improvement for the pole. Magnificent opening day for his nation. Here's the man in the bronze medal position, Petr Rattel of the Czech Republic. 39.85 in the fourth round, improved his first round throw by 20 centimetres, 775 points. Penultimate throw. Rattel and Lyshenko are different categories, so we can't really accurately compare the distances. And Lyshenko has thrown about six metres further, 46-43, but they're down to points. That's a red flag anyway, so Rattle will not advance and he stays in third place. 39.85 is best so far, 775 points. Lyshenko still in second and Silovs our leader. This is the man in second place. He's never won a major championship medal before, but that's going to change today. Sixth in the javelin in Swansea two years ago. Lifetime best today. 46-43, ah! oh, which came in the second round. That's a major throw. That looks well beyond 40. Silovs and Lyashenko are both F-37s. So we can compare the distances. Silovs with a 54.86. That's what needs to be beaten in order for him to go into the gold medal position. There's a good chance he may have set a new lifetime best. 
but it won't be enough for gold. He'll stay in the silver medal position. And it is a new lifetime best, and he's added over a meter and a half to it. 47, 97, 948 points, but Silovs is still a thousand points clear and seven meters. Silovs on the way to retaining his European title that he won in Swansea two years ago. And he finished fourth in the long jump in that. It was a regular long jump at. Didn't medal in that, switched to the javelin, won silver in the World Championships in Lyon, and hasn't looked back since then. European champion from two years back, and another silver in the javelin last year in Doha in the Worlds. And look at that. Each one of his throws today would have been good enough for gold, and I bet that one is too. Twenty-seven year old from the capital Riga. Came very close to a medal in the long jump in Swansea. Finished fourth there. May still give that a shot here. This is the penultimate round. Fifty meters forty-seven. It's not his best, but it's still on its own would have been good enough for gold. We're into the final round now, and this is Dusan Gressel of the Czech Republic. His wife, Daniela, is also a para-athlete, and Gressel is coached by the man lying in third place, Petr Vratl. So back to the men's javelin, Mike Mitchell Dutton. Coming towards the end of the competition, his final round throw. Man with his eyes firmly on Rio. Still 20 years old, his first major championship. Very impressive uh, throwing from him. 36.09 in the second round. He has Lukas Tanetsky in his sights. Can he get beyond 38.11 in order to move up into four? 36-23, stays in fifth place, but it's been a very good debut championship for Mitchell Dutton. Men's javelin is wrapping up the F37 and 38, and this is Leoshenko, who is in the medals in second place. That lifetime best of 47-97 coming in round five, 948 points. He's 100 points behind Silovs. He has to improve really by seven meters. And that obviously hasn't done it, which means that Lyshenko has the silver and Silovs has the gold for Latvia. But we'll have that confirmed in figurative form for you. Second so Lyshenko, 45-65, and in second place, he won't overtake Silovs. And here is his final attempt. 54-86 in the opening round, winning it for him, but as we've already said, his five previous attempts would have been long enough to win the goal. The shortest before this, 49-96, and he still would have won by about 40 points. European record in the first round as well. So let's see if he can wrap it up with something more spectacular. It's a bit shorter, all right. The reigning European champion has back-to-back -back titles to his name. He puts him in a strong position. Having uh, won silver in the last two World Championships, there is our now two-time European champion for Latvia, Dimitris <laughs> Silovs. And in fact, his final attempt 
would have only seen him finish second behind Lyashenko, but it's a European record anyway, everything else was beyond. 54-86, and Silovs takes the gold, Lyashenko, silver for Russia, and Rattle, bronze for the Czech Republic.